What would happen if you could stop worrying so much about what your team was doing all day and instead focus in on what you're supposed to be doing to move your business forward? Sounds like a dream, but right now you're living the nightmare of having to overcoach, overhandhold, and overcheck in on your team's work. Let's put an end to that and instead roll out super clear five hour work plans drum beats, and more of my signature tools that drive accountability and self-sufficiency deep into your team. All you have to do is join a Leadership Lab program, and I'll help you turn your team troubles into triumphs. You'll be learning and growing alongside some peers that will become valuable business friends. So why not go beyond this podcast and join us? It could be the smartest thing you do this year. Book a call with me and see what program would best fit you over at the website, stackingyourteam.com slash programs. Hello, leader. If you've ever wondered what the Biz Chicks Leadership Lab group coaching program is all about, today is your day. I'll be showing you exactly what it is, who it's for, and who it's not for. You'll know why you might need it, how to take advantage of it, when you can join, And why the heck would you want to anyways? And you'll hear some clients tell you why they love it. All of the details will be uncovered today, including how much does it cost? Who is in it already? What problems does it solve for you? And what kind of results do clients experience? And a bit about what makes it so darn special that it's common for people to renew and stay in the program, continuing to evolve as leaders. So come join me for this tell-all episode designed to help you decide if this is for you or not. And for some of you, it might just kickstart an action plan so that you can join us the next time we open the doors to welcome new members in. After all, your business and your team require regular love and care, just like your personal relationships, kids, pets and even your house plans. So welcome to the place where you can become that leader you've always wanted to be and take great care of yourself along the way. Welcome to the Stacking Your Team podcast. If you are a service-based business owner who's wanting to elevate your capabilities to lead your team, you're in the right place. Clients tell me all the time that it's hard to find trainings and insight that fits them that small business owner who's great at what she does, but never really had any training on the people side of running her business. That's exactly why Stacking Your Team was launched over three years ago as a companion resource to the award-winning Biz Chicks podcast, hosted by Natalie Ekdahl, our CEO and founder, who has been sharing her incredible free podcast resource for women entrepreneurs since 2014. Natalie and I both have a big heart for service-based business owners who are juggling life at home, in their community, their industry, and of course, in their business. We want to walk alongside you on that path towards profitability, impact, and harmony in such a way that you remain true to you. I'm your host, Shelley Warren, your team and leadership coach here at BizChicks, Inc., where I lean on my 25 plus years experience leading people at a Fortune 50 corporation. I'm here to help you by taking those complex corporate concepts and stripping them down into what better fits you, that small business owner who wants to learn all the things about leading high-performing teams, being adored by your clients who will stick with you for years, and winning every day at operational excellence. Thank you for joining me, and as we come together today, as usual, when I mention an episode or a person or any little thing, you can always find the links in the show notes. And for our long-standing listeners, you know I can't start an episode without reminding you that the team that got you here may not be the team that will get you there. Thanks for joining me today. I've been wanting to do an episode like this for a while now because you've got questions about whether or not you'd be a fit for the Leadership Lab, and you've heard that we're welcoming new members now for early enrollment. It's always fun to bring new members in early, get them set up as they ease into some core trainings, meet each other, and then of course, most often we have a strategy session so that in December, you can shift into the holidays. 
focus on your family and close the year out on a high because you have a plan and a path forward into the new year. You know, during early enrollment, I stay connected to you leading up to January with mini videos in your inbox that keep you motivated, stretched, and leaning into your role as CEO. So beyond what I just said, why is early enrollment important? Well, first off, it saves your seat. The Leadership Lab has a 75% renewal rate, even during a pandemic. So I'm very serious about inviting women into the group that have the obvious synergy and who I feel would not only fit well with the current members, but who would also bring their own perspective and matching their level of drive and passion for what they do. So during the early enrollment, you'll take action on a few key things that will help enable you to hit the ground running in January and begin to take action on your strategic plan. That is well suited for your business because you've applied the focus of the four P's. Mm -hmm. Purpose, people, process, and profit as the context of everything you do and plan for in order to reach your goals. If you're a longtime listener, you've heard me mention the four P's in the past, and I've even shared some actual client goals that they've declared out loud using those four P's. So in addition to creating a solid foundation of four P goals that we use to steer deliberate focus each month, I'll be coaching you to create goals that are defined as minor, major, and magnifier. This will help you distinguish where your efforts should be and will definitely help you make some informed decisions. And when you adopt this message, you'll see that it's easier and more effective to delegate minor goals and block time on your calendar to coach your leadership team on major goals while you focus on the magnifier goals. You'll also be learning how to compound everyone's effort for big wins. So in the first week of January, you and the other new members will join us, truly feeling prepared to take advantage of this opportunity and all that will be unlocked for you as you follow through on your commitment to getting answers, plans, tools, structure, and peer insight to uplevel your own personal development as a leader. So let's break this down and answer those nitty gritty questions that you may have. I'll theme the questions together, giving you a chance to consider all the things. Okay, first up, what is it? Who is it for? And who is it not for? (laughs) Well, the Leadership Lab is a group coaching program that's designed for service-based business owners who truly are brilliant at what they do. After all, they were the original asset in the business that attracted their clientele to them, and they've learned that they can't do it all on their own. Enter the team, which can be troublesome at times because often the CEO hasn't had a lot of experience leading people. She's trying her best, but she's often frustrated, feeling ill-equipped, and she's tolerating a lot that she knows she shouldn't, including underperforming people, reoccurring mistakes, lost revenues, and even overpaying some team members, and of course, too much hand-holding. So if you own a clinic, an agency, a firm, a studio, a center, maybe a school, a spa or a salon or a private practice, or if your services are provided virtually through a remote team, you'd fit right in. If you lead a team of five or more that can be a mix of employees and contractors, and if you're continuing to grow your team, you'd fit right in. If you own or lease a workplace, own or lease multiple locations, or have a complementary secondary business, you'd fit right in. You'd also fit right in if you are ready to lean into systems, operational excellence, and leadership development. Accountability for your strategic plan so that you have time to focus on business development, visibility, and profit strategies that will accelerate your goals and, of course, the contribution of your team members. So in a nutshell, if you are a continual learner who wants to stop being comfortable with staying still or stuck and stagnant, you would fit right in. So who is a leadership lab not for? Well, it's not for women who want to stay at their current level of revenue and impact. 
I actually just had this conversation with a potential new member the other day. I reinforced with her that it's very okay to recognize that the income level, your team size, your clientele list, and your local community impact that she's having right now will afford her and her team a great life. She could definitely stay there, refine a few things, and be quite happy. It was up to her. The last thing both Natalie and I want for any of our clients is for them to feel misaligned or overwhelmed about the decision to join a Biz Chicks program. We like to say that if it's anything but a heck yes, then the timing is off and it's really not her next best step. That's why we thoughtfully curate people and at times decline members because we feel they wouldn't have a great experience and that would be awful for everyone. We do, however, refer them to other coaches that we know and trust who have a program that could be a great fit for them. The Leadership Lab is also not for women who don't want to experiment with new tools and concepts or try new strategies or stretch themselves and their teams to expand their capabilities. It's not a program for women who want to phone it in and then wonder why they haven't moved the needle in their business month over month. I just had this dialogue with a woman who applied to the Leadership Lab recently, and she said she didn't want a coach that uses formulas because she doesn't follow formulas. I reached out to her to explain that at BizChicks, all of our coaching programs and digital courses are built on a solid foundation of proven methods, tools, frameworks, and you guessed it, formulas. I also explained that yes, some of our clients do tweak a tool somewhat to better fit their team culture. However, our clients embrace this level of direction and the prove it done for you tools, including formulas that accelerate their success. I appreciate her honesty in her application. It is always worthwhile to get these details right out onto the table. So having said that, I also want to take a minute right now and recognize that you may have that thought, you know, the one that was taught to you early in your career or back in school even that said only people who struggle and mess up need a coach. Not true. Very successful people invest in a coach because they know where they want to go. They are not afraid to ask for help because they see the value in not wasting time, spinning in circles, staying stuck, hoping things will change, and wishing they knew what their next best step was. Instead, they want accelerated results and a whole new way of showing up each day because they've learned something new, and then they boldly went and applied it. Okay, next up, you might be wanting to better understand what help you get and what problems are solved in the Leadership Lab. So I thought I'd share a few quotes from members as they described why they joined and what help they were looking for. Here's a few. I wanted more than a book or what a podcast could give me. I wanted a coach that understood the complexity of my business and would help me streamline it. I wanted tools and strategies to lead my team that I could use right away. I wanted help shifting from practitioner to a CEO. And here's what clients are saying about their experience. I love the weeks that we get into the nitty gritty training on different topics. It's all liquid gold. And here is Sabrina Davis of Port City Signs and Graphics, who's been leading her business and her team for over 13 years. Here's a bit of her talking about her own transformation as an experienced leader on episode 154. So much of what I'm hearing you say now has been so inspiring because these themes come up over and over in the podcast that you host and that I listen to. And then, of course, the Leadership Lab. And it's really inspiring, I think, to people like me who lead businesses because there's a lot of guilt that we all know and I'm able to talk with openly certainly share this with people in the leadership lab which has been so beneficial to me because it's really hard to find women leaders well I give a lot of credit to you Shelly because when I started listening initially to just the biz chicks podcast with Natalie and then shifted over to listening a lot to you learning about you through that I really realized 
that I wanted to grow and change. I sort of had like itch for a long time and wrestled with how to work on my business more and not so much in it. But I couldn't solve the constant staffing issues that I would run into because I couldn't quite figure out why I was running into these problems because I felt like I was hiring good people, but I was still having to work in it so much Mm -hmm. that I couldn't get over that hump. And when I started working with you and through the leadership lab, you've provided the tools and I've really tried to lean into those. It hasn't been easy. I'm going to be honest (laughs) in all cases. Some things are easier than others, but Mm -hmm. leaning into those procedures and processes have really helped me. And I got to the point where I was definitely hiring the right people who were ready to receive that guidance. So, and we have had to make at least one team member change that you know about Mm -hmm. during that process. And I think Mm -hmm. that some of the tools that you gave me helped me recognize that too. So what help do you get in the leadership lab? Well, here's just a few outcomes that are common breakthrough for the members. Knowing what their next best step is, it provides peace of mind and momentum to stop spinning and instead move forward with a robust strategic plan that you built and that you can confidently roll out to your team so they can get excited about the role they will play in bringing it alive. No more reacting to what's happening to you. Instead, you're deciding on what's happening next and how you do it. Another outcome is a cohesive team structure that removes you from the daily direction setting and putting out fires and constantly being interrupted and instead put the right people in the right roles and give them a direct leader who will guide and set them up for success. You know, by introducing a layer of leadership, it will undoubtedly help you scale and you will literally feel better because you're not carrying the weight of decision-making alone on your back. As well, team leadership tools and frameworks that can drastically change your team culture and how everyone feels about coming to work each day. No more guessing, no more speculation about how to solve a problem or move forward or repair a damaged working relationship. You'll be developing people and making informed decisions instead of every decision being made on gut instinct alone or emotional decisions made in the heat of the moment. You'll also get a language to lead with that spills over into your team, directly impacting how people talk with each other and how they intrinsically know what to do next how to become even more of a valued team member, and how to care for their peers. It's simply not good enough to speak or connect to your leadership team in one way and your extended team in another way. Through role modeling, your leadership team will demonstrate the behaviors that you know will directly improve your team culture and how everyone gets work done each day. Okay, next up, let's talk about price and time. This is important because I know that it's frustrating to be interested in something and you can't find the price, even after deeply searching all over the sales page or the website. At BizChix, we know that price is part of your decision process, which is why both Nellie and I are very transparent about cost and clearly show it on our website and our sales pages. The Leadership Lab is currently priced at $1,200 US a month with a minimum commitment of 12 months. Now, I say currently not to spin the conversation, but to inform you that the price will rise next summer when we invite new members to join us. The program continues to evolve and more is included each time we welcome new members in. So the price is going to reflect that. I mentioned earlier that we have a 75% renewal rate in the program. And as a business owner, you recognize the value in that number. And I'm so honored that so many clients would eagerly sign on for another year and continue the transformation into being incredible leaders. For the members themselves, it's wonderful to see their bond, their respect for each other, and their eagerness to learn from and alongside each other continue to foster. Now, I know that this is an investment, and I also know that you may be looking around for a program like this to compare to. We have members of the Leadership Lab that came to us 
wounded because they paid more than double the cost in other programs and didn't feel seen or understood, and they didn't make any progress. Some mentioned that no one ever called them by their name or even knew their business name or even understood the services they were providing to their niche. That simply doesn't happen here. Members often tell me how much they appreciate the FaceTime they get with me. And those wounded clients are now delighted and tell me often that they just can't believe the difference because they feel so well cared for here. So yes, it's an investment for sure. Taking over $14,000 out of your profits to invest in your own personal development and the development of your team is a big deal. I also know that you've been wanting to do this. You know you need to pour into yourself so that you can pour into your team. Leaders grow more leaders, and this program is going to help you do that. Here's Antonia Buevesen Brown with three locations in the south of France. Kittoland offers learning centers for children who want to learn how to speak English through engaging and interactive activities. Antonia was featured on episode 138. Here's a snip of her talking about what has been her experience in the lab as an international member, which I'm happy to see continues to grow. The biggest thing was that actually I went from a flatline structure into a more pyramid. And so structure was the biggest, probably my word of the year, a year ago, was bringing in structure, basically. And so with you and and with the help of the, the biz chicks and everything, I just want to say thanks to you guys. You know, I actually love coming along to all the meetings that we have. And it was really my safe port through the whole of 2020. And, you know, before we've you know, love Biz Chicks for many years, but really in this time, it's been incredible. So thank you to everyone in Leadership Lab. It's been amazing. Being invaluable and across the Atlantic in both ways. It's, you know, you guys were all picking it up when I was right at the bottom. You just would be like, here you go, here's a document. And I'd be like, oh, thank you. So it was a total teamwork. It was amazing. Thank you. (laughs) So let's talk about you and how else the Leadership Lab can help you. I hear it all the time that you love the free content I provide in the podcast and that you take notes and you hit the replay often. Some of you have even said that many of the episodes feel like you're attending a masterclass. Of course, I love hearing this and it makes my day knowing that you're getting some quality help for yourself and your team. But what if you could get real-time help specifically for your business What if not only were you getting my support, but you were also receiving insight from other women who were leading businesses at your level? What if the women leaders you interacted with understood your challenges because they too have well-established businesses and they know they want more ease every day? And just like you, they want to hit their goals regularly, not feel that a quarter's profit goals were a fluke. No, they want to see their success metrics on the upswing, and it's normal because they've implemented the right tools and processes across their team, improving how everyone contributes to the business, including their most recent new hire, right through to their seasoned team members. They realize that the only way to scale and still have their wits about them is to build a team structure that introduces a leadership team that drives the day-to-day operations. This opens up calendar space and headspace for her to thoughtfully take action towards business development, truly bringing her vision alive for now and the future. You know, it's common for women to join the program to get help overcoming team challenges, such as underperforming people, learning how to hold people accountable, how to talk to people in such a way that they intrinsically want to improve their performance. Many of the members know that they need to improve how they hire and fire and how to create a team structure that ends the overwhelm of having everyone report to them. (laughs) They want to create a team culture that mirrors their core values and start creating a work environment where people actually want to be a part of. They're doing this by learning how to immediately put my four favorite team leadership tools into practice and start setting expectations that close gaps and match the responsibilities of each role on their org structure. They start to see small shifts happen and then bigger shifts. And she too feels the change in how she's showing up every day too. Collectively, everyone is growing and moving forward. 
Suddenly, she's not feeling pulled into working longer hours and then feeling resentful about it. She's learning how to plan her day, set boundaries, say no, guide and coach rather than directing. And she's also feeling empowered about the accomplishments that she can make during a single CEO day that inevitably becomes a drumbeat of thoughtful time away from the business and the team so that she can plan, develop, reminisce, and get re-energized. Some of our members are celebrating actually taking vacation for the first time ever, or at least in a very long time. The difference is that they feel confident to step away from the business because they've got a solid leadership team who's committed to excellence, even when the CEO is out of sight. So tell me, What if you had 100% focused on you strategy sessions with me as part of your program? Some of the members book a strategy session with me during their CEO days or CEO weeks to help them get grounded, get motivated, and get clear on what they should be focusing on during this sacred time away from the business. I love being able to offer a combination of training, coaching with peers in addition to offering private strategy sessions that can immediately provide clarity and validation about taking your next best step forward. So let's take a minute to hear from Corey Rowan, who is the CEO of Milestone Pediatric Therapy. She's a former one-to-one client who then joined the Leadership Lab and then renewed. She leads a large team of therapists and was featured on the podcast twice. Here's a snip of her talking about forming a leadership team from her episode 158. There is so many things now that I know about a leadership team and building and learning from leaders. A lot of it I learned from you, Shelly, of how to identify leaders, how to continue to grow them. And so it looks a lot different now. And now we have this team that we say the hard things, we have the hard conversations, and I have gotten a lot better on letting them lead without my interference. I really appreciate that. I mean, all of the things that have happened in the last year, like your wisdom is laced into all of it. And so your guidance and leadership has been, I mean, it's unmatched to my person and my own journey through leadership. So what makes this program so different from other programs designed to coach you, the CEO of your service-based business? Well, it's the attention to service for our members. Mm -hmm. That is the difference. Now, I know you've probably heard that from other program directors, but it's a fact here at BizChicks. The Leadership Lab calls are set up like this. Three calls a month on a drumbeat for 90 minutes each, always recorded and always replays provided. So our first call is accountability and goal setting, where we use worksheets to document and explore what happened last month and what you intend to make happen this next month. Truly leaning into your minor, major, and magnifier goals for your four Ps, right? That's your purpose, your people, your processes, and of course, your profit. This is also a chance for your peers to applaud you acknowledge your tenacity, and hear directly from you what you're declaring as your focus for the upcoming month. Our next call is a training session with me or an expert who we've invited to join us each quarter. Training calls are an opportunity for you to look deeper at what's working and what's not working with you, the business, and your team, and even at home. It's 90 minutes of open conversations, highlighting members, asking tough questions, taking advantage of the workbooks and the worksheets to drill down into what your next best step is and how to put this new tool that I'm sharing or resource or new concept into play in your business. Topics that we cover fall into these categories, team, operations, systems, money, legacy, mindset, and impact. A full roster of guest experts, one each quarter, are planned for 2022, and I'm so excited for this. It's always a delight to tap into our BizChicks network, which is very far-reaching, and bring these experts in to inform and teach our members so that they can improve themselves or an outcome of their business in a whole new way. The third call each month is our coaching Q&A a great opportunity to ask tough questions and get some insight from me, including offering what to say when you have a communication dilemma. 
So think of this as having your own Ask Shelley How to Say It episode in real time. It's also incredibly interesting to see women from different industries share their suggestions and experiences to help each other out during this Q&A call. We're also introducing quarterly mastermind breakout sessions with curated mini groups so that even deeper relationships can get built as the experience and the mastery is so easily shared amongst the members. There's also a fourth call that I host each month for more than half the group because those women are alumni members. Those women have been former one-to-one clients, boomerang clients, and members who have renewed. This call is very casual, yet intimate, and designed as an invitation to reflect on a specific topic that they're informed of well in advance so that they can consider what is especially challenging for them regarding that theme and also what's been incredibly helpful for them that they would want to share with one of their alumni peers. Although this call is optional, the turnout rate is high, and it's lovely to see these women step up into the sometimes uncomfortable, always stretching, and often humorous conversations that are sparked on this call. So what other help is provided to you? That CEO of a service-based business who wants help running the people side of your business and also refining your foundations so that you can more easily scale and create a business that is set to be open for many, many years. Well, how about some help for your leadership team? This year, we introduced our team training library designed to serve our CEOs in a very unique way. Instead of trying to find the time, the structure, and the curriculum to train their team members about how to improve their performance and influence the performance of others that they're directly responsible to, the CEO can defer this training to me. Yes, the team library is an evergreen monthly video training experience for leadership team members. Each month, new trainings, tools, resources are loaded up ready for those team members to take an hour or two throughout the month and up-level their understanding of their role, the expectations of their CEO, and actually learn how to lead profit centers, people, processes, and outcomes. It's been so fantastic to see these individuals take advantage of this career-developing opportunity that was gifted to them by their CEO. I often encourage them to ask around and see if their best friends or their brothers and sisters are getting this kind of training at their place of work. My guess is no. Yes, some industries offer ongoing certification for compliance trainings, or there may be an annual conference they attend that introduces new products and methods to upgrade their service provider skill set. And you may have a CEO who invites a trainer periodically into your workplace for a deep dive on a particular hot topic. And let's not overlook the value in that. But I have searched and I can't find a training experience that's ongoing and designed directly to help team members of service-based business owners to improve their capabilities and to become an even more highly valued contributor. This is it. And I am over the moon about it. And I know our members are too. It's also fantastic to hear from the CEOs that their team members are using the same language, coming forward with ideas to implement the same tools, and evolving as leaders right before their eyes. They're demonstrating that they are ready to stop thinking like employees and start thinking like business owners. And it's even more fantastic when I get to see and hear from these individuals during our quarterly team call that's designed to be an open Q&A, helping them solve a problem or find the solution and even the words to make a bigger impact. In the new year, some of these quarterly training calls for these team leaders will be live and interactive trainings. The CEOs do not attend any of these calls, but they do have access to the team training library and they talk to their leadership team members during one-to-ones about what they're learning and of course they offer their own insight too. It's a fact, this level of training that's created for your team leaders would cost thousands of dollars elsewhere as a separate investment. Normally, it would also be a secondary cost for your team leaders to have access to my live coaching once a quarter. Currently, it's all included at no charge as part of the Leadership Lab program. And because we're always wanting to make things easier for you, 
the CEO. This year, your Biz Chicks team launched our digital course, Your Next Best Hire, and our clients are loving it. As a member of the Leadership Lab, you get complimentary access to this course that precisely takes you from the minute you decide you need to hire right through their first 90 days as a new hire. So whether you're hiring in bulk, seasonally, or project-based, this course will help you do it well using our best practices, templates, checklists, scripts, decision-making tools, performance reviews, and we've even included a module about how to fire because we know that the team that got you here may not be the team that gets you there. I love seeing members of the Leadership Lab delegate their hiring projects over to their leadership team to execute. Nothing demonstrates commitment to the success of their peers more than being involved in the selection process and the onboarding of a new team member. Using the course, your leadership team has the know-how to do a bang-up job of hiring, even when they're going to be hiring a leadership team member. Mm -hmm. So yes, your leadership team members get their own complimentary access to this course in their team library, ensuring the ownership and the participation for stacking your team with high performers starts with them. Again, your team leaders get training and proven tools to hire for free because it's another added bonus of their CEO being a member of the Leadership Lab. So how do you take advantage of all of this when it feels like the obvious next step in your development as a business owner? Well, you can apply today by visiting bizchicks.com slash leadership lab. So we spell chicks here with an X. So it's B-I-Z-C-H-I-X dot com slash leadership lab. I personally review each application and I will personally reach out to you to set up a short call to meet you and for you to meet me, especially if we've only ever connected online or in your earbuds. We've shared some audio clips here today of some of the members of the Leadership Lab, but if you'd like to hear more about who's in the group, you can scroll back into your podcast app and tune into our client episodes. Both Nally and I rarely have a guest on the podcast that are not a client, so dive into those episodes that are always fun to showcase because, well, our clients always have compelling stories to share and they're always so relatable. Each month, I'll be showcasing a client, so be sure to subscribe to the podcast so you don't miss your chance to meet these incredible women. And if you decide that the timing is not right for you, we will be welcoming new members again in July of 2022. Your new friends from a variety of industries are waiting for you. We know that it can be hard to prioritize friendships or groups of friends, but you'll want to nurture your relationship with these women because there's no judgment, no drama, just a lot of respect for who you are and what you're trying to do in the world, along with a space to laugh and cheer each other on, especially on those tough days. We all want to learn about you, help you, support you, and chat with you inside our private Facebook group, where we encourage you to not wait until your next call to get an answer. Ask your question, tag me or tag others, do the work, get the results, and keep moving forward with confidence. If you'd like to find like-minded women who are taking deliberate action to also be surrounded by other leaders so that they can up-level their leadership skills collectively, consider joining us in the Leadership Lab. Early enrollment starts right now. And you'll be provided foundational trainings, resources, and much more so that you can get some immediate help and then ease into the holiday season, ready to join us in January. Our wait list continues to grow. So if you've always wanted to join the Leadership Lab, enroll early, get your seat, get on track for an experience like no other for both you and your team. You know, leadership can be exciting, challenging, and lonely at times. So don't go it alone. Let me help you create the team and the leadership structure that you've been creating. So until next time, remember, if you have a dream, you need a team. So let's get stacking yours today. Today.